on a rocket ship adventure. You'll never get into college if you don't play your video games. Moms are now thinking of video games in a whole new way. If you don't play your video games, no desserts. Because of V-Smile, the first educational video gaming system. With V-Smile, your kids will learn letters, numbers, and love learning almost as much as they love playing. You can stay up one hour later if you play your video games. V-Smile turns game time into brain time. You're a genius! Take an exciting ride through Toy Town with Naughty and his taxi. It's a bumpy ride when Sly and Gabo decide that they want to be the only taxi service and put a magic spell on Naughty's car. Naughty doesn't know what to do when his car goes crazy through Toy Town Square and almost runs over Mr. Plod. Join Naughty, Mr. Plod, and Big Ears as they take a wild ride through Toy Town. Watch Naughty's Taxi Service and other Naughty Adventures. get that tray for you. And I found a lovely table over here. Muffy, I made you a handy study guide for tomorrow's test. Everyone's being strangely nice to Muffy. It must be time for her annual slumber party. Yeah! She's probably planning all sorts of girly things. Well, at last year's party, they dressed up in costumes and jewelry. <laughs> oh, no! The ancient Egyptian jackal zombies are blocking the time portal! Let's get them! Like I said, girl stuff, and her parents arranged for acrobats from the Peking Circus to perform. Uh, that's kinda girly. And they imported the newest video arcade games. And there was an ice cream machine, and a fireworks and laser show, and there was... Okay, okay, how can I get my invitation? You can't. It's girls only. But what if I paint my nails? I'll do anything. You'd be crazy not to want to go. I can't believe I'm invited to Muffy's slumber party. This is a disaster. Growing up with Arthur, the latest episodes of the Emmy Award-winning series from Our Time Family Entertainment. We only have a few hours before the museum closes. Can I come, come too? Ugh. Can I? No, this is for me and Dad. You're spending the day with Mom, D.W. But I want to go to the museum too. <laughs> <laughs> Could you take D.W. today? Kate's sick and I've got to get this account finished by tonight. Unicorns, can we? No. Daddy. This is scary. Can't we see the uni? No. Can't we see the uni? No. Sir, this might not be the exhibit for your daughter. I said no. <laughs> Arthur, she's right. Why don't I take DW to see the unicorn dolls and meet you back here in an hour? I used to wonder what little sisters were for, and I finally figured it out. They're there just to wreck things for us guys and our dads. Whoa! This is the farm where Connie the cow lives with her mommy and daddy. That's their house. There's her mommy and daddy. And there's Connie! Every day, Connie explores the farm and the forest. Hi, Mr. Beaver! Good morning, Connie. She's just a little cow, so she's always learning new things. The rain is cold. That's snow, and it falls when winter comes. She has lots of friends, <laughs> like Nibble and Hedgie and Sam and Buddy and Donna and her little ducks and Henry. Hello, Connie. Hey, leave my food alone. Oh, a stick that speaks. It's not a stick, but an insect. Connie likes to help her friends, too. We need rain, and it only comes from the clouds. I will bring you water. I want you to rain Ooh. over the fields. Thank you, Connie. Connie! Connie! And every night, after a busy day of exploring... Oh, look, it's Connie! 
Connie goes home to her mommy and daddy and has a good night's sleep. Connie the Cow, a new series for kids like me.